Today we're going to be revisiting an older video to see what sold, what I made a profit on, and what I probably could have left on the shelf. Okay, well today we are back in Maryland, and we are in Thurmont, sitting outside the Goodwill. We're about to head in here and see what we can find to buy and flip for a profit. So here we go. Well, it looks like we have the whole back room to ourselves. <laughs> We have praying hands, and I see a paperweight in the back. Three forty-nine for the paperweight. It's not terrible. It's probably made in China. That would be my assumption. But you know, a piece like this is twelve to eighteen dollars, so there's profit to be made there. And I'm going to stick that in my cart and check out this bird. Let's look at the frosted glass bird that is missing its beak. <laughs> Look, praying hands, praying hands. What is that? That is some sort of flower. A dome. There's a vase. Hmm. I like that. What is it? $4.49. Eh. Again, this one is also probably made in China, but at $4.49, there's some money to be made there, and it's a pretty blue vase. We're not going to discount it just because it's made in China. We're just going to say, well, it's not Murano, but it's still pretty. That is art pottery. Signed on the bottom. Seven forty nine. Hmm. Alamino. It looks like the name Hank Alamino. I can't believe I may have just gotten that because normally I could stare at the bottom of a vase for like ten minutes and be like, I don't know what that says. I don't know. I like the glaze. You know what that glaze reminds me of? Kind of is the uh, Bill Campbell on the inside. I think that's why I like it. I'm gonna stick it in here. I like the looks of that. What does that say? That one I'm not gonna be able to read. But I like that dish. $3.49. I'm just getting ready to head over towards the fresh cart, but something over here caught my eye. What is that? Crazy looking thing. We're doing a top test on it. Twelve forty. That is wild, isn't it? That is a wild looking thing. My gosh. <laughs> oh shoot, I'm laughing because I'm like, you don't need it, Jocelyn. And I'm like, I know I don't. Thank you. But that would look really cool on that secretary desk that we moved into the booth. It's like just the right, just, it's just right. It's just right for, for that. How much was it? I'm holding my hand right over it, 12.49. Yeah, I think that would look really cool on that secretary desk. That's where it's going. Cards are really loaded up. There's a cute little wash basin. All right, I do see something in here I'm gonna try to there's a cool car. Let's see if we can get down to that. There's the stuff we want. Look at that. Salt and peppers. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I, was just, I was just saying to them, I'm like, that's one thing about this Goodwill is when they bring out new carts, they take it very seriously. They get as much as they possibly can. <laughs> no space is wasted. Owls are what I was going for, so. Okay, little owl. Owls. There we go. And then the kitties. Can't leave the kitties behind, right? Ooh, everything's shifting. Oh my gosh. Here, kitty kitties. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. <laughs> so cute. I do like these, but I don't know, those are like, eh, they're not as exciting. All right, I think I got some pretty neat pieces out of there. 
This is so funny because I pulled these out and I looked at them like this. And as I was putting them in my cart, they looked like this. And I was like, oh my God, what just happened? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> They're double-sided, oh my gosh. I'm like pulling them out and I'm like, oh, those are cute. Gotta put them in my cart and suddenly, a little terrifying. All right, let's see if we can see anything else. Oh, look at the kitties over there, they're cute. Like a burger in there. We really have to analyze um, the baskets before we start digging through them. <laughs> figure out the best game plan. There's a pair of candlesticks. Brass candlesticks. Are they still a thing? Do people still like brass? I never know. Sometimes people like brass, sometimes they don't. I think at that price, people could still like brass. They're not solid though. Oh, $3.49. Those could go into the booth as well. Well, our total spend there in Therma was $63. And I feel like we did pretty good, especially when that new cart rolled out. And that was pretty exciting. I'm always nervous to dig in the new cart, though, because I just feel like everything's going to come tumbling down. Um, and it, it was a little scary, but we got some pretty cool salt and pepper shakers. Um, and yeah, we did all right. So I am now sitting in Walkersville, but you guys are going to have to wait for this video. And uh, I guess I'll see all of you tomorrow. So long. If you enjoyed this video, we will be posting videos just like this every Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. So make sure you stay tuned. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. And I have included a link to the playlist down in the description.